I grew up in upstate New York, so anytime anyone talked about the best place to go for veterinary medicine was always Cornell, Cornell, Cornell. So ever since I was a little kid, that's just always where I've wanted to go. The faculty from day one have been amazing here, especially when we came into the clinics. Coming into clinics, faculty are right there is one of the things I'll probably miss the most about leaving here is leaving this faculty and all of their mentorship behind. The problem-based learning approach, I think because we start that from day one, we essentially start thinking like clinicians from day one because they give us a case, we go through it page by page, we go through the blood work, we go through all the anatomical approaches, we go through everything in an integrated approach that is still preparing us for actual real life as a veterinarian, as a clinician. So when we come into clinics, we've had that mindset for the first two years of this curriculum. So when we come in here, we're not just stranded thinking in compartments of anatomy, of physiology, of we're thinking everything all integrated together. We already know how to ask questions to clients. We know the different approaches that we need to be looking for to integrate everything from starting from the first day that we walk through the door. When we came in, I definitely knew that I wanted to do equine medicine, but as I came here, met more faculty members who are the tops in their field, I definitely decided that an internship would be the way to go. All of the faculty members and my advisors here really helped mentor me in what path I should take to get the best out of what I want to do with my career. My advice to anyone who wants to be a vet is to not lose track of how amazing this job is. You're going to graduate and you're going to be able to work on any animal, whether it's this big guy or a dog or a two pound kitten, an alpaca, a fish, whatever you want to find your passion within veterinary medicine and stick to that and never forget it. That's what's helped me the most is finding my passion in horses and being able to really stick with that. And this was my dream.